First, I would like to congratulate you with your brand new StoryChief account. You're only a few steps away from scaling your brand awareness online. Yeah, before we can do that, we first need to set up the basics, starting with your workspace. So let's get started. First of all, what you can see here is your dashboard. This is a central hub that shows you everything that is happening in your company. Here at the top of the page, you can easily access your articles, social posts, media library, campaigns, calendar, and analytics and insights. Here you can see your social media performance for the last seven days, your story performance for the last seven days, and your upcoming stories which are scheduled, in review, and in draft. The first step is connecting all your channels. This step is crucial. If you don't connect all your channels, you won't be able to publish your content and you won't be able to get important insights into your content performance. So click on the top right corner here where you see your name and then click on channels. Here you can see that you can connect your personal website, your social media channels, your referral marketing, so your ambassadors and press, and your email marketing. Also, be aware that you already have one channel connected and configured, which is your William blog. The William blog is a free and StoryChief hosted content hub where you can publish your articles immediately. But now let's go back to the dashboard. So in the dashboard, you will find a shortcut to connect your social media channels. So just go ahead and click on connect your socials. Here you'll see all the different social media channels that you can connect. So for example, you can connect your Facebook page, Facebook group, Twitter, Instagram, LinkedIn page, LinkedIn profile, and so on. So this means that you can publish your social post linked to an article, video, links, images, or galleries to your social media channels. Also, if your colleagues don't have the time or the energy to post your company's content on their personal profiles, you can also add your colleagues personal LinkedIn profiles. As such, your content can be easily shared via them too. As you can see, we also have other very important social media channels such as Pinterest, TikTok, Google My Business and Slack. I'm going to start off by connecting my Facebook page. To do so, simply click on connect now. Then you go ahead and simply follow the steps here. Okay. Uh, and voila, simple as that, my Facebook page is connected. Just click on save settings. I also want to make it clear that you can connect multiple pages, multiple groups and profiles all in one channel. I'll go ahead and connect the rest of my social media channels. So I'll fast forward the video and see you in a bit. Now that all my social media channels are connected, I can go ahead and close down the window. Since I've connected my social media, I already can see some more information here. So you can see the size of your audience of all your channels together. You can see the engagements and impressions that you've generated with your post in the last seven days. So this data is already shown as soon as you connect your social media channels. So it doesn't matter if you've published your content already or not. If you want to get even deeper dive in, get more information, just go ahead and click on view insights here. Here you can really see a channel breakdown next to each other. So you can select, for example, the audiences of all your channels together, the engagements and impressions. So let's click impressions here. If you want to even have a deeper dive on a specific channel, you can do that by clicking here on the left side. So for example, for your Facebook page, you get a much more deeper insights and you can select it for a certain date here. So it's pretty self-explanatory. So this is the first step done. The next step is connecting my website. So to connect my personal website, I just need to go ahead to the top right corner, click on my name and then go ahead and select channels. Uh, so once here, you can connect your own WordPress, Drupal, HubSpot, you can connect whatever CMS website you are using, and you can connect more than one CMS website. We also offer an API here, so you can even use it with a custom built website. And all this is done in just a few clicks. For each CMS, we have a different setup of instructions. So for example, let's go into WordPress here and click on add a new destination. Then you need to follow the setup instructions here. Um, so the first step is installing the WordPress plugin and then put in the unique encryption key in this field and then the URL and it's as simple as that. 
That means that each time I publish an article, it will be published in WordPress as if I had done it in WordPress itself. The layout and formatting will adapt to the WordPress theme. This will work similarly for all your channels you own and want to connect. However, also be aware that we can help you with setting up your channels. You can just go ahead and quickly chat with us. So for example, let's go ahead and go to Sitcore here. If you select it, there you can see that you can go ahead and just click on chat with us. However, for all the major CMS systems, we do have plugins and the setup is quite straightforward. In my case, I won't be publishing my post to WordPress. I will use the William platform here instead. So the William platform is already online and I can easily access it if I go ahead and click on my name in the top right corner and then I go down and I click on view blog button. So if I click on it, it shows me this view, which brings me to the website builder. So this is where all your articles will be uploaded. But now let me show you how this will look like for visitors. So here at the top, for example, you can change your logo. You can go ahead and add categories, um, but you can also add lead capture forms. And if I go down, for example, you can add call to actions. So not only on the overview page, but you can do this for the article uh, itself. Um, so these features will lead your visitors further down your funnel and it's very mobile friendly and a light environment to host your content. Additionally, you can connect it to your own domain. We'll be covering the setup of this channel in the next video.